What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the Mutt 17 Top 5 Base Elite Wide Receivers. Coming in at number 5, DeAndre Hopkins. You know what it is, bro? A lot of guys are going to go wild uh, and say, yeah, you know what? This guy's much better than that. But, you know, look, he's coming out of he's coming out of his shell. I think he's going to be one of the best receivers this, this year in the National Football League. He is kind of slow when you look at Mutt ratings, but he looks faster on the field. I don't know how that really corresponds. I'm not going to get into that right now. But he's coming in at number 5, and it's well-deserved for him to be in the Top 5 because the guy's been a great receiver for a very long time. Number four, A.J. Green. This dude has been a beast for me in fantasy every time I've gotten him. Um, I don't know why they have his speed so low, even with his higher rated cards. Uh, it's never made any sense to me because the dude burns people cons you know, consistently, so I don't really understand. But we have to wait and see what happens with that. But I'm very, very happy he's getting shown some love. Coming in at number three, Odell Beckham Jr. Look, bro, it is what it is. I think he's one of the top wide receivers in the league. He was the cover boy last year for Madden. But we'll see what happens this year. I do believe, though, that his highest cards during the year are going to be rated a lot higher speed-wise. So I wouldn't take, I wouldn't put too much, um, you know, confidence into this kind of thing right here. It's a base elite card. It is what it is. Everybody's slow as hell. Coming in at number two, Julio Jones. This guy's a damn beast, bro. This guy's a mother effing, bro, bro, a mother effing beast. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I really don't know how he's number two. But let's continue to go down the list and see what's happening. But Julio Jones is a beast. If he can stay healthy, major problem for defenses. Coming in at number one, Antonio Brown, of course. Only at 89 speed, though. And then he's 5'10". I got to see how height corresponds to everything in Madden 17. But until then, we have to understand that Antonio Brown had a killer season. Outrageous amounts of receptions. 136, 1834 uh, in yardage. The dude is a beast. We just have to wait to see how it corresponds to, you know, this year on the field, how he's going to go with the Steelers' offense. Everybody's coming back. I really like the Steelers' O. Let's see if they're going to be able to share the ball and put it around the way it's supposed to be done. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Definitely subscribe. A lot of Mutt 17 content coming to you August 23rd when the game is released or possibly sooner. Until next time, one love.